H-E-B. A lot of the things that did not get accomplished last month um, got moved over to this month. Howdy everybody, my name is Kaylee. I, if you're new here, um, I am a recent graduate from Texas A&M University. I work as a junior content copywriter um, at an advertising agency here in Houston, Texas. And welcome to today's video. Um, we are calling this one, Get My Life Together. <laughs> because um, my last few videos have been about um, traveling and then I spent the last um, three days of the last week at work and today is Sunday and I still have not unpacked. I got back on Tuesday and my apartment is just kind of a mess, um, but it's the end of the month. So this is also combining like my monthly reset. Um, so today I'm going to be um, cleaning up my apartment, um, getting some food in my um, place because I'm weird and I think that you can only go grocery shopping on Sundays unless absolutely necessary. Um, so I'm picking up groceries later today and I have more laundry that I'll need to do um, while I'm eating dinner at my aunt and uncle's later and setting up my budget and goals for November because um, we'll go over my October goals too because I didn't meet a lot of them and I want to try better because, I mean, October was weird, like, you know, I was traveling, so, like, some of these were a little, eh, will I actually be able to do this? But, November is pretty usual, um, so yeah, but I'm going to church in, like, an hour and a half, um, so what I want to get done this morning is, um, unpacking and cleaning my closet, because there's kind of just clothes everywhere right now, um, and I want to get that all cleaned up. So I know what I have to wear, um, and I'll know what laundry I have to take later. So, yep, we're going to get started with that. It is now much later in the day. Actually, it is 3.15. Um, I went to church and then just got back from eating lunch with some friends. Um, so, you know, you could say that was still me getting my life back on track, you know, getting into routine. It's what I would normally do on a Sunday. Um, but I'm picking groceries up between 4 and 4.30 from HEB, of course. And um, between then, between now and going to dinner at my aunt and uncle's house. I need to finish putting stuff away, um, wipe down surfaces and dust, vacuum and pick up and put away groceries. Um, and then there's a couple other things on my to-do list, but I think it's laundry and then put away my clothes that I'm gonna do while I'm at my aunt and uncle's. Um, oh yeah, and budget and stuff. So I gotta get a move on. Um, because I've only got a few hours before I go to my aunt and uncle's. Um, so we're gonna queue up some more time lapses of me cleaning. Stanley, where are we? He's too distracted by the people because we're at H-E-B. Are there a lot of people around Stanley? Are you happy getting to see people? 
Are you happy right now? Are you a happy boy? <laughs> He's so cute. y'all it has been a very productive um afternoon yeah it's afternoon um i vacuumed wiped stuff down put stuff away um meal planned for the week um and yesterday i actually um set up my budget and november goals for this next month and sort of plan some content um, that will be coming your way very shortly. Um, so I'm gonna show that to you guys now. So as you can see, I accomplished about five of my October goals. Um, I went to all the adulting 101 classes I could go to and I got to visit Izzy in Boston. Um, I sort of tried a new recipe. I didn't actually make the new recipe, but I tried new food um, while I was in New York and Boston, so I'm counting it. Um, and I did post on Instagram the way that I wanted to and to YouTube. Um, TikTok, I was like on the way there, but then went to New York and just did not have time for that. Um, so a lot of the things that did not get accomplished last month, um, got moved over to this month. Hi Stanley. Um, like I kept social media the same of youtube twice a week um but i added one bonus video and then a post on instagram three times a week um same as last time and then i changed tiktok to post two times a week and i want to add um the like videos that i posted on youtube to pinterest that are more of the high performing ones or ones that i think could be high performing um, and see if pinterest helps at all and then wellness i want to walk stanley every day before work um I was on the way to doing that in October and then got back and just did not um, finish out the month strong. Um, I want to drink two of my 32 ounce bottles of water each day, um, talk with God every day, whether that's like a set quiet time, praying in the car, worshiping in the car, um, whatever it looks like. Um, I just want to spend some time with him every day. Um, I also want to read two books. I finished one that I had started months before in October um, and then started a new one on my trip and I want to finish that one and hopefully get through another one this month. Um, and then finance, I want to develop a savings plan and have like different types of savings that it's going towards um, and I'll talk about that a little bit more when I show you guys um, my budget. And then I want to think, think philanthropically. Um, I took a strategic philanthropy class in college um, and kind of forgot about some things until I was really convicted in this last um, church service and life group where we talked about some of this stuff, so I wanna get back to that. Um, figure out what I wanna do with my wellness stipend that I get from work and start saving money for Christmas gifts. So these, this is the overview of my November goals. Stanley, what are your goals for November? Why there, get enough sleep. I feel that. Okay, now I'm gonna show you guys my budget. Um, so I'm gonna start a screen recording. And to start, I have this big spreadsheet. Um, I have different tabs for each of the months. And this is just my monthly budget, how I break down stuff um, with the fixed expenses um, and subscriptions, and then variable expenses, um, just what I project for them to be and hope to stay in. Um, and then I have my income over here on the right side. Um, if we look back at October, um, even though I spent a lot more than I typically do in a month, I was still under my big total, which is what I was aiming for. Um, I always aim to just keep my big total um, 
in the positives. Um, but of course this month was a big spending month because I went on a travel trip um, and had to buy flights and a train ticket and I ate out um, just about every meal when we were in New York um, in Boston um, so there's even some things that aren't quite in here yet because I still owe someone some money for paying for some things um, while we were out because it was just easier to put it all together um, so I still need to do that but thanks to Carter Sullivan, who also does these like monthly reset videos, um, this is where I got my inspiration um, just to set goals like this um, and budget. She uses every dollar um, just to plan out her things. And so I have my income in here with my paycheck amounts. Um, and then I, like I said in my goals, I want to start thinking um, philanthropically. Um, and so I want to... Uh, donate 10% of my um, paycheck to um, church um, and tithe. Um, and then in Christmas, uh, I will, or in December, I'll change um, this budget part, this part of my budget up a little bit because um, I want to do some special things around the holidays. Um, and then I have my savings. Um, just emergency fund short-term stuff, uh, start saving for other travel things that I want to do because um, I have some trips that I really want to go on next year and then a long-term savings just for like the future, retirement, buying a home, you never know. And then with housing, I've got it all listed out for my rent, water, gas, electricity, internet, trash, sewer, pest, drainage, all the things that they charge me for. Um, and then transportation, this is my estimate for gas. Um, it normally hovers around $100, which allows me to fill up four times a month, so like once a week. Um, just depends on how much driving I do. Insurance, and then we've got food between eating out and then groceries, and then just the f more fun money of like, if I wanna buy new clothes or my phone bill. Um, just some entertainment stuff. Seasonal is buying decorations, um, and then my subscriptions. And then I have a Stanley budget with pet care um, because I have enrolled him in the like um, band filled with PetSmart, their like um, wellness plan. Um, so like he will be going in to get his vaccine soon and that will be covered within this plan. Um, and I think it's like $35.99, $40 dollars a month, um, something around there. Um, but yeah, that will wind up saving me some money in the long run. And the extra money will just be for like food and treats and stuff. And now I'm gonna put some things into um, Notion for this next month's content plans. Um, for now, I'm just going to put in uploads. So... I'm gonna do that real quick and then I'll get back to you guys. I've planned all the content for this month. Um, but yeah, now that I'm done with that, it is time to continue the stretch of normalcy by going to dinner at my aunt and uncle's house. Cause I did that just about every Sunday before I left. And uh, it's been a couple Sundays since I've seen them. So we're gonna head over there now. Howdy y'all. Um, so don't mind my teeth. I was just with some friends um, having a little bit of a spooky time with them for Halloween um, and that involved a drink. But I got my laundry done. Um, I It's almost midnight so I'm gonna wait and put it up tomorrow but I promise I'll put it up because my life Feels like it's back together. Feels normal again. I'm hanging out with people, saw family. Um, but I need to go to bed now so I can get back to my morning routine. Um, but yeah, thank you guys for joining me and getting my life together. Maybe this will motivate you um, to get some things cleaned up and together in your life as well. Um, not that your life isn't together, but we all have moments where, you know, things just feel a little chaotic. Anyways, it's late. I don't really know what I'm saying right now. Um, but thank you guys for joining me. Um, 
and I'll see you guys next time. Um, have a great rest of your week. Love you guys. And remember, do what makes you happy. Bye. Thank you.